Now, as we mark the somber occasion, Hoosiers are finding ways to honor the lives lost and the sacrifices made. Our Matthew Fultz spent the day at the Indianapolis International Airport for a special memorial this morning. If you visit the Indy International Airport, you'll notice a display. This is a piece of the World Trade Center that was recovered after that horrific event on 9-11. I actually spoke with some Hoosiers who say the memory of that day is still fresh in their mind. The star-spangled banner echoed through the Indy International Airport Monday morning. Dozens of airport officials, TSA workers, and first responders honored the nearly 3,000 lives lost on 9-11. It's as fresh today in my memory as it was on that given moment. George Kessler has worked logistics at the airport for the last 34 years. He was on the Indiana Task Force One team that spent 10 days at Ground Zero after the two towers fell. I personally didn't rescue anybody, but I issued body bags. I issued equipment. I, I issued the stuff that the guys could do their job. Monday's ceremony brought back memories as he looks at this piece of steel from the World Trade Center on display. He hopes as time goes on, 9-11 will not only serve as a day to remember who we lost, but as a reminder to slow life down. We can never forget them. We can never forget the moment. Uh, and it should be etched in everybody's mind and soul to be proud where you live and what we have. And airport officials tell me this piece of the World Trade Center will be on display until the end of the day here at the airport before it will be transferred back to Fire Station 1. Reporting at the Indianapolis International Airport, I'm Matthew Foltz, 13 News.